Hello everyone, welcome back to Crazy IGCSE. So today we'll be learning an IGCSE maths topic, quadratic sequence. So we'll be learning how to find the nth term of a quadratic sequence. And the formula for quadratic sequence is a n square plus b n plus c. And we know that a given sequence will be a quadratic sequence if the second row of difference is constant. An example to this is this sequence 9, 16, 25, 36 and 49. This one has difference as 7, 9, 11 and 13. After that we can still find a common difference and once we try to find again we get 2, 2, 2. So when we get a common difference in the second row so this is the second row and this is the first row. Now the second row when we get a common difference, it is known as a quadratic sequence. So to, to find the nth term of a quadratic sequence, first we know that the formula is a n square plus b n plus c. So to find a, we first find the second difference like we did uh, before. Then we divide that difference by 2 and to find b, we write the sequence in the question, the initial sequence in, from the question. And then we write the answers which we get from A. And then we find the U sequence. And for C, we repeat the steps which we uh, follow in B. And N means the, uh, the position uh, term. So like it could be 1, 2, 3, 4. So that's the position term. So first to find A, we find the common difference. So here we get 6, 10, 14, and 18. Then again we find the second row of difference since it's a quadratic sequence. And we get 4 as the common difference. Now the first rule we apply is to divide the sequence, the common difference, by 2. So we take this 4 and then divide it by 2 and we get 2 and the formula is a n square so what we do is we add n square to this so to find b this is to find b first we write the initial sequence 3 9 19 33 51 from this part and then we find 2 n square so n is the position so the position here is 1 2 3 4 and 5 so now we know the n over here. So then we just apply the 2n square. So it, if, if we need to find the first position, it becomes 2 into 1 square and we get 2. Then we do 2 into 2 square and we get 8 and so on. So we keep getting uh, the numbers. So one, then we need to subtract the initial sequence from the 2n square values. So we get 3 minus 2, 9 minus 8, 19 minus 18, 33 minus 32, and 51 minus 50. And the new, new sequence we get is all are equal, 1, 1, 1, 1. After that, again, we need to find the difference between the new sequence. So the difference between the new sequence is all minus 0. Uh, and by difference, I don't mean by doing 1 minus 1 is 0. We need to know... 1 minus or plus what gives you 1 so this number minus or plus what gives you this number so here 1 minus 0 gives you 1 so here your b becomes minus uh, sorry 0 so your sequence will be until now your sequence is going to be 2 n square plus 0 n so to find c, we'll do 2n square plus 0n and we'll again substitute so it becomes 2 into 1 square plus 0 into 1 and we again get 2, then we get 8, 18, 32 and 50. Then we find the difference between these two and the difference will be 1 will be 1 so you get 1 as your difference and in your for your c the difference which you get here will be your final c value
So your final answer becomes 2n square plus 0n plus 1. Uh, it's not really necessary to put 0n in middle because it anyways does not give any particular value. So you can also write 2n square plus 1. And if you want to reconfirm your answer, you can always substitute the values. For instance, you can do 2 into 1 square plus 1 and you'll get 3 as the answer. And you can keep trying it with each position uh, term. So if you want to know the second number of the sequence, so you can do 2 into 2 square, you get 8 plus 1, so you get 9. So you can substitute the uh, values to know if your answer is correct. So this is the end of our video. Thank you for watching Crazy IGCSC. Please subscribe to my channel, like my video and keep the bell icon on so you get notified on more of my upcoming videos and also comment down in the comment section below if you have any doubts or any suggestions. Thank you.